We are um, inspired by biological neural functions, so how they function and emulating them in hardware and in an energy efficient way. So we're looking into how we can actually have this neural computing or brain inspired computing with very energy efficient implementation. And to do so, we are doing this with novel devices, so phase change materials, 2D materials, all the way to circuits, devices, and also to demonstrators and applications. So in a nutshell, this is what Neron is about. So energy efficient computing based on uh, oscillatory neural networks. It went very well. And uh, also we got a lot of uh, positive feedback from the reviewers and the PO. And indeed, we went through this um, very challenging, I would say, start and um, midway into the project due to the current pandemic which limited a lot of our travels and um, exchanges in terms of uh, insight visits. And nevertheless, all the consortium and we all were all very committed to continuing our communications to make this a very meaningful effort. And we have seen and you can see that this actually was very effective and productive. We were able to show some proof of concepts of uh, oscillatory neural networks. We got also even to have some demonstrations to show, and this was purely collaborative work. So regardless of the challenges, I'm very happy to say that it was a very productive first midterm of the project. The first half year of the project showed us that indeed we can, this associatory neural network, we can compute very efficiently, and we can also show it that it can work for example, for a robotics application based on some uh, robots with the build-on sensors for obstacle avoidance. Now we want to take this a little bit further. We want to see how we can mature these ideas and to see maybe other type of applications can also be addressed, such as in healthcare, maybe even for autonomous vehicles where there are many built-up sensors and you need to make online decisions. So it, there, I think this also the application side where ONN can play a role and knowing its properties and advantages is something we want to explore further. And the second part of it is to have this transfer of knowledge somehow. And this is what we are working with our um, one of the partners into the project. So AI merges to have this transfer of knowledge so other SMEs or other startups can start to use this new type of neural networks for their real time, for example, image processing or decision making. So we are looking into maturing Neuron, of course, and also to have this transfer of knowledge into other type of applications or domains that where ONN can really be a key player and in terms of energy efficient computing.